the daily exam indeed is a masterpiece of Ignatian spirituality in which we thank God for all that he's given to us we beg him for the grace to see our lives we review our lives in the light of God's grace we beg for the grace of forgiveness for our failures and then finally we renew ourselves to be all the more faithful to the Lord and to fight the good fight and to win the battle there are many fruits that come from the practice of the daily examine the first fruit is we grow we grow in our prayer life because this indeed is a prayer it's a prayer it's a spiritual exercise second is that we become more and more aware of God's presence in our lives in him we live and move and have our being third we become more and more aware of the reality of desolation and consolation within our souls these various movements next we become more keenly aware of how weak we really are how fragile we are how inclined we are at times to give in to our human weakness and with this another grace would be that of preventive medicine with the renewal and the keen awareness of when we fall the why of our falling sometimes the where of our falling then we can place certain measures to prevent us from falling to the same trap the following day indeed the daily examine is a spiritual masterpiece so my friends find a specific time you're going to do the daily examine find a specific place you're going to do the daily examine also find time to do com good spiritual reading on the daily examine and we suggest that you read father tom father tim gallagher's book on the daily examine and then also we strongly encourage you to find some type of spiritual direction because saint ignatius insists very much that we have some spiritual accompaniment some spiritual director to help us to walk in the light and to arrive at the Lord we are not made to do it by ourselves we have to have some person to help us to do it well so my friends undertaking the daily examine informing this as a habit indeed can be an extraordinary grace for you it can be an extraordinary means of growing in holiness so why not make that proposal today to make the daily examine you'll be eternally grateful to the Lord for making this decision give thanks to the Lord for his good for his mercy endures forever